Welcome back to the channel, my ninjas. My name is Joey Moss, Bad Boy Gaming. We got some spoilers to go over. There are, I mean, all the lands were released today, so we're just gonna go go through this kind of quick. Um, there, are, there are some key cards. There's a new Planeswalker. There's a few new rares. Let's just get right into it. Uh, make sure you hit the like button, and if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. I don't even think if you're watching this that you're not subscribed. So there you go. First off, we got a swamp. All the artwork, it's pretty basic. I'm not going to go over it. Bogart Brute. Uh, it's a 3 2 with Menace. Goblin Warrior. That's kind of neat. That is kind of neat. Oh, we're going to go through this quick. Some more new lands. Um, I do like that swamp land in the middle there. And that island on the far right's not too shabby. I do believe so. Uh, some new forest art. Gotta love the greenage. Gotta love the greenery. That one on the far right's pretty dope. Uh, Tectonic Rift. What does this do? It's an uncommon. Destroy target land. Creatures without flying can't block this turn. Well, that's completely different. Not bad. Then we got some more islands. Ooh, that island on the far left looks different. Floating glaciers. Why the heck not? Uh, that artwork with a almost what was those. They look like beehives, but they're not. Uh, what the hell is that? That forest. I don't know. Something going on there though. Inferno Helion. It's got Trample. It's a 7-3 at the beginning of each end step. If Inferno Helion attacked or blocked this turn, uh, its owner shuffles it into their library. 7-3. I mean, if that thing had haste, that would be ridiculous. Uh, it'd probably be a mythic. But it does not. So that is that. Uh, Helion, sure. It's something. We got some new planes. Dragon Egg is back. It's got Defender. It's a 3-drop. When Dragon Egg dies, create a 2-2 Red Dragon creature token with flying. And a mountain. This creature uh, gets plus one, plus zero until end of turn. This is zero, two. Talons of Wildwood. Enchant creature. Enchant creature gets plus one, plus one, and is trample. For three, return talon, Talons of Wildwood from your graveyard to your hand. There is that. Millstone. Millstone is awesome. One of my favorite cards from way back in the day. It's a two drop for two. Tap it. Target player puts the top two cards of the library into their graveyard. Moving forward, Gargoyle Sentinel, Defender to 3 drop. 3 until end of turn, Gargoyle Sentinel loses Defender and gains Flying. There are some reprints for sure we're looking at. I think this whole board right here is. Vampire Neonate, sure, it's a 1 drop, zero three. 3 For Deuce, each opponent loses 1 life and you gain 1 life. you got to tap it. Explosive Apparatus is back, it's a 3 drop. Sacrifice Explosive Apparatus, it deals 2 damage to any target. Naturalize, destroy target artifact or enchantment. Good to see that back. Mind Rot, target player discards two cards. Pretty cool card. I've always liked that. Greenwood Sentinel, it said two drop with Vigilance. Deuce, deuce. New, another elf is out and about. Macabre Waltz. Macabre. 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 Well, you know, I, I swear to God, I, I, I've pronounced this card correct so many freaking times, but we're going to drop it up. Macabre. Uh, return up to two target creature cards from your graveyard to your hand, then discard a card. Gift of Paradise, Enchant Land. When Gift of Paradise enters the battlefield, you gain three life. Enchanted Land has add two mana of any one color. That's ridiculous. Definitely a whole lot of ramp going on um, in 2019. Infectious Horror. Whenever Infectious Horror attacks, each opponent loses two life. It's a four drop deuce, deuce, a zombie. Essence Scatter, Counter Target Creature Spell. Welcome back. Um, we just, they just use the Amonkhet artwork there. That's fun. Daggerback Basilisk. Daggerback Basilisk. Say that four times fast. Actually, to say it goofy. Daggerback Basilisk. Death Touch, Deuce, Deuce. It's a three drop. Pretty cool. Hired Blade, three drop flash. It's a three, two. Aether Tunnel. It's a two drop. Enchant Creature. Enchant Creature gets plus one, plus zero, and can't be blocked. That's not too bad. Make a stand, another uncommon. Creatures you control get plus one, plus zero, and gain indestructible until end of turn. It's a three dropper. Soon we're going to get into some rares and mythics here. Duress, target opponent reveals their hand. We all know you choose a non creature, non land card from it. That player discards that card. Doomed Dissenter. When Doomed Dissenter dies, create a 2 2 black zombie creature token. Aegis of the Havens, of the Heavens. For Deuce, target creature gets plus one, plus seven until end of turn. So that's fun. Uh, Gaia for Guide, it's a 3-drop reprinter. For 3, target creature you control can't be blocked by creatures with power 2 or less this turn. It's a 3-deuce. Crash through. Creatures you control gain trample until the turn. Draw a card. Not a bad card. Bone to Ash, 4-drop. Counter target creature spell, draw a card. There is that. Here's a new rare. Transm... 
transmogrifying. Transmogrifying, sure. Transmogrifying. One. It's a three. Three drop. Um, one enters the battlefield with three charge counters on it. For one tap, it ret remove a charge counter from, sure, wand. Destroy target creature. Its, contr its controller creates a 2-4 white ox creature token. Activates ability only any time you could cast a sorcery. Well, that's kind of neat. That is pretty neat. Uh, I do enjoy that card. You can combo that with that one card that destroys all uh, all tokens. There you go. That could be fun. And then just keep... Uh, get, wait, it's three charge counter move. Yeah, that could be fun. Why not? Woodland Stream, Stone Quarry, Highland Lake... We've got some dual lands. Foul Orchard, Forsaken Sanctuary. Tezzeret, Artifice Master, 5-drop. What's this bad boy do? Let's take a look at this bad boy in detail. Can we open it up? Make it a little more clear. Tezzeret, Artifice Master. Legendary Planeswalker Tezzeret. For a plus one, create a 1-1 one, one colorless Thopter artifact creature token with flying. Zero draw card. If you control three or more artifacts, draw two cards instead. I must say, I have never seen so many Planeswalkers in one set in my entire life. I believe some of these are going to be in the dual decks and whatnot, so keep that in mind. Uh, minus nine, you get an emblem with at the beginning of your end step. Search your library for a permanent card. Put it onto the battlefield and shuffle your library. Whoa, that's nasty. That is pretty nasty. That's a, that's a game ender right there. Pretty freaking dope. All right. So Tezzeret's looking pretty fun. Rupture Spire. Uh, enters the battlefield, tap when Rupture Spire enters the battlefield, sacrifice it unless you pay one at one man of any color. I believe that's a reprint. If not, I could be mistaken. Arcane Encyclopedia for three. Draw a card. That's not too bad. Uh, three drop and then three, and you can get that sucker going. That's, that's really not too bad. Rock's Oracle. It's a five drop. When Rock's Oracle enters the battlefield, draw a card. Druid of Horns. Four drop. Whenever you cast an aura spell, that targets Druid of Horns. Create a 3-3 three, three green beast creature token. I can see that being abused somewhat. Double cast. Two drop. Both mountains. Oh. When you cast your next instant or sorcery spell this turn, copy that spell. You may choose new targets for the copy. That's not bad at all. Sorcery, though. If it was instant, that'd be nuts. Ravenous Harpy. For three... Flying, it's a one drop. Sacrifice another creature. Put a plus one, plus one counter on Ravenous Harpy. It's a one, two. Psychic Corrosion, three drop. Whenever you draw a card, each opponent puts the top two cards of their library into their graveyard. Next up, I believe this is a reprint of Pelica Worm, seven drop. Trample and Pelica Worm enters the battlefield. You gain seven life. When Pelica Worm dies, draw a card. It's not really that bad. Just a large casting cost. Might be a little difficult to bring out, but. I do like big old bulky worms, so that's fun. Gallant Calvary, four drop. Human Knight with Vigilance. When Gallant Calvary enters the battlefield, create a 2 2 White Knight creature token with Vigilance. That is something. Sift is a four drop. Draw three cards and discard a card for four. Hmm. Knightly Valor. I believe this is a reprint. Five drop. Enchant creature. When Knightly Valor enters the battlefield, create a 2 2 Knight creature token with Vigilance. Enchant creature gets plus two, plus two, and has Vigilance. So knights are definitely going to be a threat. There's that Blanchwood armor. Yeah, that does look familiar from Urza's Saga. Enchant creature. Enchant creature gets plus one, plus one for each force you control. Um, I don't know if I went over Detection Tower or not, but if I didn't add a colorless for one, tap it until end of turn. Your opponents and creatures, your, yep, the Hexproof. So there you go. I mean, that is all the spoilers. What is your guys' favorite card from this set? I mean, this puts an end to all the spoilers that have been going on for the past uh, couple weeks here there are a lot of really neat cards out here um definitely the elder dragons coming back uh dragons being a thing again that's going to be a lot of exciting uh, a lot of excitement um, and just endless amounts of planeswalkers quite a few reprints uh, that were much needed very impressive uh, very cool to see all that cleansing nova if at any point you just want to pause it go ahead this card i think is going to really shine Ah, uh, this core claw terror. Uh, that looks fucking frickin' frickin' fa fa. That looks frickin' awesome. Uh, Bone dragon. There's that. Plague mare, lightning mare. All the mares. Horse is gonna be a thing. Omni science getting a reprint. Um, another elder dragon. Alpine moon. A uh, new hydra. I mean the mist caller. The, the list goes on. This is a really cool set. Crucible of worlds. Awesome. Magistrate scepter. Uh, Resplendent Angel, New Mythic Angel. That's pretty fun. Um, the Elder Dragons again. Elvis Chan Clan Caller, whatever. Scape Shift, Reprint. That's freaking dope. 
uh, the Bullis, uh, more Elder Dragons. I mean, a Johnny. I mean, holy smokes, man. This set is just filled. More Planeswalkers, more Dragons, more Planeswalkers, more Lilianas. I mean, wow. This set is truly just amazing. Death Baron getting the reprint, the other Tezzeret. Um, more Planeswalkers, more, more though, my goodness. Uh, I do recommend you pick up a box. Um, and also, if you guys haven't checked out in the description of every video, there is a link to Ebates. Ebates is a way for you to save money if you purchase Magic the Gathering, and you can save money at a billion other stores. All you got to do is go through the link in the description, um, sign up for it. It doesn't take much. You get 10 bucks for signing up and making your first qualifying purchase. I think it's like a $25 purchase or more. So maybe go ahead and get yourself a fat pack or get yourself uh, uh, some magic cards or a booster box, whatever the case may be. Um, and, yeah, you can be saving money. I think the last box I purchased, the last box I did purchase from of uh, Corset 2019, I pre-ordered. I got it for $77. There was a discount on eBay for 15 bucks off a, a $75 purchase. And then on top of that, Ebates, I think, was like 5 or 6% off, whatever it was uh, the other day. So that comboed in with cash back. I mean, uh, it was like 75 to 77 bucks I spent. Really freaking inexpensive. Uh, definitely Ebates is the way to go. Make sure you guys sign up. And uh, again, hit that like button if you have not already. I can't go through all these. Um, I kind of can, but there's just so freaking many to go through. Oh, there, I think that's it. There you go. So suppose they've been going on for over a month and a half, almost two months. Wow. All right, guys, I do appreciate you. Make sure you hit that bell because live stream is back and it can go live at any time. So keep that in mind. As always, PLA.